One of the things I enjoy most about travel photography is finding interesting subjects and having great experiences. And along the way, or sometimes even after I get home, I like to share some of those experiences through my photographs with others. Lightroom makes the process of sharing images remarkably easy. You can publish images directly from Lightroom to a variety of online services, for example. I've got an image here, a classic scene from Salzburg in Austria, that I'd like to share with others. We'll go ahead and take a look at the new Adobe Ravel service, as well as how I can post this photo to Facebook very, very easily. On the left panel in the library module, I'll scroll down to the Publish Services section, and here I can see the various services that are available. I can even add other services to Lightroom if I'd like to. I've already configured my Adobe Ravel account as well as my Facebook account, so now Lightroom has permission to publish to both of these services. Let's start by taking a look at Adobe Ravel. Publishing an image is incredibly simple. All I need to do is drag an image. For example, I'll drag this image from the film strip directly onto my carousel under Adobe Ravel. I can then click on that carousel and go to grid view so I can see all of the images. In this case, one photo that is ready to publish, the image that I've just dragged to my carousel. I'll go ahead and click the publish button and now Lightroom will process this image and add it to my Adobe Ravel carousel. I can then view and share this image on my mobile devices or on my computer directly using the Ravel app. With the process complete, I'll go ahead and switch to my Adobe Ravel application, and you can see I have an image that was previously added to my carousel, as well as this new image that I've added via Lightroom. Switching back to Lightroom, we can take a look at how we can also publish this image to my Facebook wall. I'll go ahead and drag the photo from the film strip once again to the wall photos item for Facebook. I'll switch to wall photos and click the publish button. And then once again, Lightroom will process this image and then post it to my account on Facebook. And once that task is completed, I can switch to Facebook in my web browser, and I'll go to Wall Photos, that's the gallery where I had added this particular image, and I can view that photo. And I can also, of course, comment on this photo if I'd like to. Obviously, for the most part, I would wait for other friends to comment, but I'll go ahead and add a comment myself. I'll just add a caption, essentially, as a comment. There we go. I'll press enter or return to add that comment. And now switching back to Lightroom, on the right panel I'll scroll down and you can see that there is a comments section. I'll click the refresh button and Lightroom will check my Facebook account to see if any comments have been added to this particular photo. You can see that my comment now appears. I'll go ahead and add a reply. I'll just type great and press enter or return to add that comment and now from within Lightroom that comment will be added to Facebook. I'll go ahead and switch back to the image in my browser and refresh that page and I can scroll down and see that sure enough I now have both of those comments reflected in Facebook as well as within Lightroom. So I'm able to share images very easily but also interact with my friends very easily directly within Lightroom. Here we've taken a look at just a couple of examples of some of the published services that we can use. There are, of course, others, but the key thing to keep in mind is that Lightroom makes it incredibly easy to share photos with others automatically.